Yeah. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another edition of the Missing Tooth Mukbanger. We are back in our studio after all this travel that we've been doing. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us on this huge travel eats and panorama cruise uh, food that we did as, uh, during our cruise vacation on the panorama. Uh, we really enjoyed all your comments and especially thank you to all of those that uh, joined us on both of our channels, Missing Tooth Mukbanger. Uh, a and B Variety TV as well as the Zen Spirit guys. So thank you very much for hanging out with us We are back in the studio for a couple weeks because we're going back on another cruise. I am recording this on uh, Sunday after my um, Niece's uh, birthday party and so of course I'm doing a leftover eats that I normally would do So let's get into what we're gonna be eating today Of course, we got to bring out the rice. <laughs> of course, we got to bring out the white rice That's a lot of rice, but I'm not gonna eat all of it. I just want to show you guys the white rice right on this table. Anywho, this is um, some of the leftovers from uh, yesterday. We have some chicken adobo, check that out. Chicken adobo wings. Um, I am eating the, my mom made it with wings this time. So if anybody knows what chicken adobo is, it is uh, adobo period, <clears throat> whether it's pork or chicken, is the national dish of the Philippines. So I'm gonna put that over here. So you guys, I'm gonna be tearing this up right here. Look at that, ooh, chicken wings. And I'll have, ooh, it's just falling off the bone. It's just falling off the bone, look at that. <laughs> it's falling off the bone, chicken wings. All right, I'm gonna use some of this um, sauce a little later with the rice, but we're gonna go into our next dish, which is michado, actually. Michado here, my mom's dish, famous dish. My The hubby loves some michado, so that is michado. It is a beef stew. So we have all beef, all meat families uh, that are gonna be part of this show today. <laughs> so um, it is a tomato-based marinated stew with potatoes and carrots. There are some potatoes and carrots in there. Um, and it's cooked down to like, the meat just kind of, it, it just kind of, it macerates really well. So you can kind of see how the meat is macerated there. I'm not a big potato person, but hey, might as well show you the potato too. All right, and last but not least is our pork sinigang. Sinigang is a, a sour soup made usually out of tamarind, um, a tamarind soup mix, but I'm gonna eat mostly the, veg the veggies. I'm gonna show you guys that here um, and sip on the soup a little later. Um, so I'm gonna eat mostly the veggies. You guys can see it it's green beans Filipino green beans and some bok choy can y'all see that hopefully you guys can see that okay let's taste it okay. mm. come on yes yeah, sour 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 all right so that's it we're gonna come back with dessert in a little bit so you guys can see the dessert that I'm also gonna be eating but this is a leftover eats guys so it's not gonna be too much, it's whatever I put on here is what I'm gonna try to eat. Um, oh, excuse me, I'm just dropping things over there. So here is traditional um, adobo. We're doing, we did it with chicken wings this time. Mm. Filipino dishes usually have like a sauce to it. So we're gonna put a little bit of that. Oh my God, that adobo sauce is so amazing. <clears throat> Thank you guys for um, watching our videos during the cruise. We had such a great time uh, filming the, the the ship and filming the food and the eats and all that other stuff. So I'll put a, a playlist up here so you guys can check that out if you haven't yet. Mm. Mm. Look at that. It's literally fall off the bone, y'all. Fall off the bone. Right. Mm. You put some of that juice over that rice. It is to die for. Die for, die for. Alright. Let's get into this caldaret um, michado. Look at this meat. Look at how tender this meat is, guys. This usually has a little bit of sauce too, but there is a little bit of sauce. Let me get some of this sauce right here. Look at that sauce right there, guys. Can y'all see that? Put it over the rice. 
like you always do. Ooh, yeah. So get a little bit of that plus the meat right here. Bichado. There's that spoonful for you guys. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm. I want some more of that sauce. No. Filipino food is so good the next day, guys. Because all of the flavors just kind of marry together. I mean, it's good when it's fresh, but the next day even better because all the flavors just marry together and you get a good bite. Let's put some of this carrot. Oh, I'm a mess. Can I put this carrot? Oh no! <laughs> I'm a mess! I can't even get that right. All right, here it is, guys. We have some some beef, a carrot, and some rice with that with that sauce on it. Mm. Mm. Oh my god, so good! <clears throat> Last but not least, let's get some of these uh this pork sinigang veggies. It's a pork sour soup made out of tamarind it's a tamarind soup mix that they use or you can use fresh tamarind as well so we got all three uh, meat groups here mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. it is super sour Y'all, I did a great job. I normally don't eat everything that's on my plate or everything that's on my board, right? I always have some left over. I did pretty good today. I'm picking my chicken now, y'all. I don't even care. <clears throat> this is gonna be my last bite. Oh no, we're gonna come back with some dessert. Yes, we are, Lord. We're going to come back with some dessert. Because we sure didn't have some dessert over there at the party. Ooh. Look at that. I'm not going to eat all this rice. I'm going to be good. It's only a couple more spoons left, but we're going to try. Mmm. To drink, guys, we have Luzon Calamansi juice. Check that out. Calamansi is a, a native citrus fruit in the Philippines. Amazing flavor. So many health benefits. Calamansi juice. Mmm. Oh, yeah. All right, we'll be back, clean this table out so I can show you guys what I'm gonna have for dessert. See you in a little bit. Bye. All right, guys, we are back. I had to change the little table that we had and have time to clean it. Um, but I wanted to get show you guys. Oh my gosh. This is, <laughs> shout out. Shout out to Miss Jean Hartman. Thank you very much for making such a fabulous cassava cake guys so check this cassava cake out it has burnt ends right there you see the burnt not the ends but the, the corners and stuff that's my favorite part of the cassava cake you guys probably saw the short that I did on it I'll put it up here so you guys can see my first bite of it um, we threw it in the fridge yesterday when I got home and look at it's really solid now so check that out cassava cake she made it I made I placed an order and she had it ready for me and the family loved it first bite first bite when I'm already biting on it there it is mmm it's made out of cassava 
Mm, some eggs. Condensed milk. Look at that. Some Eden cheese. The family loved it. My cousin texted me talking about it was bomb. Mm. That's my dessert for today, guys. That's my dessert with this meal today. Mm. Check out our continuing mukbangs here at home. It's naughty November. So, you know, Angelo's gonna be a little bad with his diet. <laughs> It's naughty November, so we're gonna be real bad with the diet. You'll be seeing me eat some naughty stuff. And this is the first, um, one of the first things you're gonna see. What, what you gonna do? What is you gonna do? Thank you guys. Mm. Oh, that cheese is amazing. She puts this processed cheese on top, eating cheese. Shout out to Eden Cheese. Has a really good salt to it, salt texture, salt taste to it that complements the sweetness of the dish. Mm. To die for. All right, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks so much for hanging out with us uh, here back home. Uh, continue to watch us. We'll be doing some Naughty November um, videos here until we get back on the ship. We will be on the ship um, in on Thanksgiving, so just a few more weeks from now. So you guys hang out with us. We'll be doing a couple car bombs here and there. We'll be filming here at home as well. So miss you guys from the studio, but we'll be back on that ship and back at Cabo for another Carnival Cruise adventure on the Carnival Miracle. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs>